guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here my name is Teresia and today I'm gonna be doing a summer dress haul my last haul of the summer this is like a mid summer dress haul the nights are getting colder and I, I got some stuff from Shein and work with me bro I'm always on here on there anyway so I picked up like a couple of pieces i honestly got some dress i got some jeans some shoes it's just a little bit of a mix but it's mostly dresses i originally ordered a bunch of dresses from shein then recently i went like a couple of like two weeks ago i ordered some shoes so i'm just going to show you those as well but let's get started and be sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe down below if you're not subscribed already thank you so much if you're already subscribed i hit 850 subscribers today so that's really great and i'm so grateful thank you guys so much you don't even no i can't wait to hit a thousand subscribers but yeah let's just get into this haul so i'm gonna start with some dresses that i don't have here i'm just gonna put them on the screen so the first dress i'm gonna talk about is this green like ribbed kind of knit dress like ribbed knit tube top tube dress is that a thing tube dress that's the first one i actually wore and unfortunately i already stained that i got oil on it and that's trash i've been wearing it like backwards because i like that dress so much it was like my favorite dress out of the entire haul and i stained it with oil the first time i wore it but yeah that dress was mad pretty i love the color or is mad pretty i love the color the material is honestly mad freaking thin pro is that it's like so pretty but the con is that like i cannot wear it on like hot ass days like super hot days because literally the fabric is so thin it shows like sweat marks like literally the first time i wore it it was like 90 something degrees that day and i came home and my roommate my roommate's daughter was literally like is it raining outside i didn't even realize that there was like so much sweat until like i looked in the mirror i was like no <laughs> it's not raining outside and then i looked in the mirror and i was like yo why is it wet like this like it shows every drop of sweat that you can ever even imagine <sighs> So yeah, it's super pretty, but it's definitely not made for like hotter days, but it's so cute though and just pretty comfortable as well. It's not like, it doesn't even like really ride up or anything, so that's amazing. Unlike the dress that I'm about to tell you, which is the second one that I do not have here. This one is this white asymmetrical hem cut out halter neck dress, bodycon dress, all of them actually no not all of them are body con i'm lying so yeah the next dress this one it's asymmetrical hem this little cut out right here and it's a halter neck super cute dress i did not think i was even gonna like that one as much as i did i kind of just wanted just kind of put it in there it was actually one of my last options last choices that i just put in there it was like really really cheap all of these dresses were super cheap but it was so cheap i was like why not and i kind of just wanted a white dress so i was just like why not this one though nothing's wrong with it really it's just that it's white white black girl makeup did not go together when i got home yo it looked like i was rolling in mud first of all i guess the only thing that's wrong with it is that it kept riding up like it kept riding up and i kept having to like pull it down every five seconds and um when i got home there was so much like makeup on that dress it was kind of like crazy and that was not cute thankfully it was stuck outside so <laughs> so dirty with makeup which is why i can't like show it up i can't hold it up right now it's just so gross looking i'm just like i'll just show you guys a picture so yeah that was super cute i think that's actually my second fave dress out of the entire haul actually that um, one's super cute. Um, I think it would also be a little bit sheer as well. I just wore like dark underwear underneath it and honestly I don't really wear bras to begin with. Also the halter neck was a little bit too big for me. I got a size I think either small or extra small and yeah the halter neck was too big for me so I had to like tie it in a knot behind my neck. Like literally the halter neck being too big for me my boob was literally like popping out at the side my boobs are just always popping out you would have thought i had like double d's or something it's always fucking popping out just love being out there i guess um yeah let me make sure there's another item that i bought that i don't have right here i think that's it right? um i don't know if i should tell you the shoes because one of the shoes i don't really want to show you either because 
the same dilemma i got a black pair of shoes and i got a white pair of shoes i'm just gonna quickly go through the shoes since i'm already talking about it the black pair i literally just got a second pair of the ones that i had bought originally i showed these in my um she and accessory haul i had gotten these for like six dollars they actually lasted longer than i thought they would but yeah it's the end of summer and they're finished already but i really like them they were really comfortable and i wore them with basically everything they look cute literally everything literally everything so i got me another pair i think i'll just keep those more busted ones and wear them like i don't know running errands and stuff and then like use these more so for i don't know when i go somewhere that's not running errands six dollars you already seen them but they were definitely worth it for me and the second shoes i'm gonna put the picture up because i'm literally not gonna show you they got so dirty so fast i literally don't know how they got so dirty that and the dress got so dirty on that day like if you literally would have thought i was doing the most and i literally just went out and got some food like i don't know why they got so dirty i do have a habit of like putting one foot on top of the other so i don't know maybe i did that unconsciously but i don't remember doing that i don't know but anyway they're similar to the black ones they're like the same like mule type but they're flats i definitely don't have any flats i mean i do i do have like some flat sandals in my closet that i haven't worn all summer but they're actually just really uncomfortable i don't know why i keep them they're like really uncomfortable they're not even my style anymore i think it was like my ankles like it made my ankles hurt or something my ankles and my knees hurt me like i don't know why it's just like weird so yeah i don't really have any flats to wear so I bought a pair of like espadrille, espadrille flats. I haven't had espadrilles either in a really long time. I really like espadrilles also. I, I think they go with like literally everything. So I got me a white pair. I honestly got a white because, well, first off, the espadrille looks so nice with like a lighter color anyway, lighter color shoe. But also I only got a white sneaker shoe because I have my little basket bag that I was like raving about that one thrift haul that I had thrifted and I realized I haven't worn that all summer long and I was gonna wear it and then I was like it doesn't like go with my everyday black platforms so I was like well if I'm gonna buy some shoes let me just buy these right now so I got a white mule espadrille shoe and they're really cute i really like them they're super comfortable i was kind of worried that it was gonna be so cheap it being cheap like that that the espadrille the basket part would like poke my feet but it literally is so comfortable and it was the perfect shoe just be wearing about but it just gets really dirty well it got really dirty hopefully that doesn't happen every single time because now i have to like wash them which is sucks like what the fuck i mean like how did they get dirty like that i don't understand so anyway let's get back to dresses the rest of the dresses i actually have here this dress i don't even know maybe i should just post the pictures of this one too but this dress is obviously i mean it's not obvious it's literally that dress that literally that literally every single girl has this summer but it's just a spaghetti strap cut out roll it looking bodycon dress they have in the long style and they have the shirt style i have the shirt one again the fabrics of those these three dresses i just mentioned the fabric is really like thin though like the fabric on this is like super thin yeah i got that dress i thought i just needed a black dress i felt like i didn't have much black dresses which is, was a complete lie i lied to myself when i got this dress i do have a ton of black dresses actually i even have one that i haven't worn yet even though it's more like i'd say for fall but still i completely lied to myself what the heck i have so many black dresses but anyway, I already got it. So yeah, I really like that style actually. I like the longer ones, but I just really wanted some like mini dresses cause I felt like I didn't have much options for mini dresses this summer. So I got some mini dresses. This one's really cute. I haven't worn it yet. Um, I really want to wear like casual, but like I feel like every time I try to wear it casually, it just does not look very casual. So, I mean, honestly I wear it anyway, but it's just like, it just hasn't been it yeah so this is a really nice going out dress for very very cheap i tried to like wear it with a black bucket hat and my platforms and it just looks so out of place it looks so dressed up yeah that's really cute though i really like this one and next up is my third favorite dress of this haul which is this one i already posted a picture on my instagram it's very pretty the color is very nice 
I feel like I see dresses like this all the time, but I never really seen this color as yet. I personally haven't. Let me know if you have, because I haven't. But I really like this like brown and orange. I think it looks really nice on my skin tone. It actually looks really cute with my makeup today. I like used orange eyeshadow as blush did that and i think it would look really cute with this dress but yeah as you can see it's like this tie-dye bodycon orange and like rust red color and it has like this like ruffle like hem hems all around super cute love this so much and also i love that this one it's the um quality of the fabric is actually like better than the rest of them this is a good nice breathable thick fabric i really like this dress it's really good they did their thing for this option because quality their style is there and it's also the style that well it's a color in this style that i've never seen before so you know they got maybe got there first maybe yeah i love this dress so much super cute i think this one out of all of them has gotten the most weird for me because like i said fabric is good i don't have to worry about the sweat stains like with the green one obviously it's a good color so i don't gotta worry about it being dirty i only wore that white dress once nextly i got two dresses because i just also wanted some dresses i've been wearing dresses a lot this summer i just want to be like comfortable and have stuff that i can like throw on and just go so cute and comfortable you guys might have noticed in like my vlogs that i have this blue and red dress i'm gonna be going gonna go into details on how it looks there's so much to say but i have this blue and red dress and i've been living in that too because it's like the length is comfortable and i just feel really pretty in it every time i wear it i just wanted to get more dresses that like gave me that type of comfort and also vibe the next two dresses are kind of like based off of that this next dress especially is based off of it it's very similar the sleeves are the same even though on the other one i tie i usually tie the sleeves as a halter i might do that with this one if i get a chance to wear it before the end of summer i should wear this today it's not really the vibe i have today i like i'm wearing this outfit and below this top anyway and but it's really actually it's not that hot today is it I don't know but i kind of like i'm liking this vibe but i don't think i'm gonna wear this outside don't even know what i would wear with it oh actually i'd probably wear it with some satin pants and just some shoes honestly just chill out but i don't know maybe i'll wear it maybe i won't i might show you guys before the video is over so stick around to the end because i'm gonna get dressed right after this probably anyway love this little dress it's so super cute it has this like bustier i want to say thing going on on the cups can't really see if i'm putting these very too close i don't think you can see oh there you go like you can see that it has like this type of bustier type of cup on it really love that little detail and it's a zip up dress in the back I don't know if it's too small for me. I don't think it's too small for me. I was trying to zip it up and I couldn't get it to zip up. And I asked my own roommate to help me and she couldn't get it up either. So I'm hoping that that was just like a snag in the um, zipper. I honestly haven't checked since because I was in a rush that day. I kind of had to go. I really want to wear this though. But I really like anyhow that it has this like slit at the bottom. I think that always is a nice touch. Who doesn't love a good slit? Super cute. And anyway, it's just this black floral pattern. Very similar to my um blue and red one. But yeah, this one's super cute. And I feel like it'd be super duper comfy on like a everyday thing. And then lastly, we have this dress. This is actually my least favorite dress out of the entire haul. I actually thought it would be my favorite because it's like this cute little pink color, but it's like mad long. First off, it's mad long and it's like super see-through, but this color is not pretty. I like the pattern. It's like super blurred out. It's like this bubble gum pink pretty dress. And I like the like, just the shape of it but it's just so long like i kind of want to go get it cut i wish i was one of those people that could like sew i also thought about returning it but i really like the dress overall i just don't like the length it's just it looks like a nightgown like that looks like a nightgown but anyways it's pretty pink color 
baby doll looking dress with this like ruffle sleeves super duper cute and this is also zip up on the side like it looks kind of big but this honestly snatches od at the top there are like these like lines throughout it that gives it like a kind of like a ruffly layered ruffle type look I, I don't know what that's called honestly but i really like this dress but i just hate that it's so long like i literally am not gonna wear this while it's this length so i'm gonna have to like go get a cut or something like or i should like go learn how to use a sewing machine because i feel like i'd be doing that way too much for clothes anyway to not know how to sew with a sewing machine that's that i also got one pair of jeans and these jeans were super duper cheap actually they were like one of the cheapest jeans that they had on the site and they're like so nice like i was surprised i thought they were gonna be like paper but they literally aren't they're dead like heavy denim regular ass jeans like she really is the place to go like i think i bought these for like i don't know maybe like 10 to 15 dollars i think they were 15 but like that's pretty cheap they're like these high-waisted high-waisted light blue denim jeans i think these will get a lot of wear for me in like the fall winter because i feel like i just wear same jeans every single day <laughs> every single freaking day and my last pair of favorite jeans they I actually shrunk them by accident, so I can't really use those anymore, but these would definitely be a great replacement. They're like high-waisted, they fit really nice, and the legs are like super duper long, so if my, I don't know how to laundry ass, ends up shrinking it, it'll be fine. I honestly shrink my clothes on purpose anyway because I'm kind of small, so just you know to fit. And on these jeans, oh, they're just a size small. What fabric is it? Oh, it's 85% cotton, so that's pretty good. Pretty good quality jeans for super duper affordable price. And these are going to be like my BFFs this fall winter. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And leave a comment what your favorite item is in this entire haul. And I'll see you in my next video, whatever that is. Maybe hair review. Maybe it'll be a vlog. I don't know. But anyway, bye guys. See you in my next video. I love you.